All right, we had a question in the Telegram chat um, about how to get this EMA ribbon, or what it's called, right? It's EMA ribbon. Um, and you just type that in under the indicator thing, uh, right, right up here. You click that little icon, and then this comes up in the search. You just type in EMA ribbon. And the one I'm using is this one uh, by this guy. I'm not even going to attempt to say that name. <laughs> but you click that, right? And then... Uh, you go into your settings, right? And here's my settings. This is just what I use. The MA8, 14, 21, 34, 50, 100, 200. I don't really use this one. Uh, and you'll see in a second how to set that up as well. So you hit you go through that and you can pause the video, rewind it if you want to, you know, see that. Um, the style, then you go over there. And then these are the colors that I use, right? Um, for the first one, right? The 8, the 14, the 21, 34, 50, 100, and 200. Uh, so you could try to match that up if you want, and then you just uncheck the ones that you don't want. If you only want three or four, then you just uncheck them uh, based on what you want, right? So the one, two, and three will line up with your whatever first you have in here, right? So hopefully that makes sense. Uh, that should be it. Default. Everything else is default, and that should do it. So you get all these moving averages in one indicator. So, um, you know, I used to, before I knew what the hell this was, or I knew someone created it, I would have like each one of these and that would count as uh right so would count as eight indicators if i wanted to do all this so uh now you can um get it all in one so uh that helps it helps greatly if you have one of the lower tier uh trading view things because i think they only let you have a handful right so um hopefully this helps y'all and i appreciate you being here